Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of The Valder Beebe Show, a new kind of spiritual talk show. Broadcast on FM radio, internet websites, and print publications. I am well known for that celebrity interview. Interviews that we conduct in studio, by telephone, and by satellite with today's most fascinating people. I'm Valder Beebe, and I'll see you on ValderBeebeShow.com. Carmichael. She's going to be offering quick ideas for good food, fast, and she did that with Family Circle Magazine. She also hosted several TV shows, including Simply Your Life on the Fine Living Network and Family Circle and Calling All Cooks on the Food Network. Uh, <laughs> my audience knows a lot about you. I found that out over the last couple of days. We always put out something on Twitter. They know a lot about you. They oh, think no. You're yeah, in a good way, too. Oh, good. I hope it's not scandalous. <laughs> not scandalous. It's good. It's all around decorating food and the holidays. Let yeah. me ask you, can we get some holiday advice from you and yeah. talk about some holiday in the day tra in entertaining with some latest trends? What do you got for us? I'm here to tell everybody, just let's everybody take a deep breath and just let's ha enjoy our own party. One way you do that, I, I, this is my mantra, is to get everything done, as much done as you can ahead of time so that you're actually enjoying your party with your friends. And as far as trends this year, I'm seeing a lot of themed parties, which I think is kind of fun. You know, whether it's, uh, you know, the last year that was really big, it was the, the, the uh, bad Christmas sweater parties. But now it's, you know, everybody, are, are people are incorporating games, like having a white ele elephant gift exchange, which are always fun. Um, tr how about trying a holiday movie-themed um, charades game? You know, I think games and themes kind of get people in the spirit. And also, as far as food, I tell people, again, keep it very simple. And, and people like tradition, so I kind of, with the main courses, stay with uh, traditional, the, the ham, the turkey that everybody comes to expect, and then start playing around with the sides, with the you know, desserts, with the appetizers, with the side dishes. Um, and, and bring in things that maybe I haven't tried before, and, and then it gives people a really good variety of things to choose from. Well, we got okay, we got the food. What about holiday beverages? Holiday beverages, we've got to have our holiday beverages. <laughs> and I, like, um, I like to have a, a, a sort of a signature cocktail or a punch, and this year I think everybody, uh, rosé is, uh, wines are trending very big, so I uh, came up with a rosé sangria that everybody loves. And then if you need a non-alcoholic version, the, uh, apple cider sangria it, with your cinnamon sticks and some sliced apples. People love some cranberries in there. And, you know, I think that uh, everybody likes a really great cup of coffee to finish the evening. It sort of caps off the evening. We can relax and sit back. And this year I'm thrilled to be partnering with uh, Jura C Z6 Automatic Coffee Maker. I have a Jura at home. And I'm basically my own barista. Uh, what's so great about it is it has the barista technology. And it, it's not so complicated. It's, like a, it's called pulse extraction process, which basically brews the most amazing espresso. And what's really fun about it, it's the first coffee ma uh, machine that automatically switches from heated milk to foam. So at a press of a button, uh, your guests can go up to it press a button and they can get a latte macchiato or a cappuccino or a flat white. And it's almost like the after dinner show. People love it. If you go to Jura, that's J-U-R-A dot com, um, you can find out about this machine. Uh, it's changed my life. I ha I've had mine for years and I adore it. Oh, yes. <laughs> Whenever we have a gathering, people gather around the coffee maker now. <laughs> it's true. It is. They love that. <laughs> Even got non it. Yeah, everybody wants some coffee. They everybody want to see the, coffee. Yeah, what it can do. And that's yeah. a great coffee maker. Yeah. So as we go into the holidays, how can we have some tips so we can enjoy our own party, Cece. That's well, I think really I, important. You know, I think that, again, uh, make-ahead dishes are great. And also, not getting too too crazy. Like, you know, holidays about family and tradition. You know, you've got, again, we've got our ham, our turkeys, our main things. And for me, the, 
my tradition and, and a lot of people's tradition is the green bean casserole. casserole. I grew up with it. I always use Del Monte green beans. You, I was like, I don't mess with this recipe because it's how, what was served to me as a child and what I serve my family and friends. And basically, using Del Monte green beans, it's easy. It, they're, they're so fresh. They're basically packed right out of the field. And it's just a dash of sea salt. And they're always perfect. And the recipe, as you know, you've probably made it. I think everybody's made it at this point. I think it's everybody like, has. Yeah, it's just like cream of mushroom soup, the Del Monte green beans, some of those yummy that I end up eating all of, the, the canned uh, fried uh, uh, onions. Throw it in the oven for 25 minutes, and you're done. And you can put, cover that with foil, put it aside, and you've got that. And it's, it's make ahead. They're also um, having, uh, Del Monte's having a uh, sweepstakes on their Facebook page. It's called Pick Aside Sweepstakes, and you can win a thousand dollars and get a, a, all these little gifts, a, a casserole craving set. So, folks, go there. You can also get inspiration on how to kind of personalize your green bean casserole if you want to make it untraditional and throw in your own flair. Go ahead and do that. <laughs> well, that's a good inspiration, yeah. CC Carmichael. And then, and then quickly, desserts. We've got to go to desserts just really quick. Again, traditional. And I found these wonderful sweet and salty holiday treats from Frito-Lay that are so easy. Just pick them up, put them in beautiful little bowls. Rolled gold pretzels dipped in chocolate and peppermint. You've got the wavy lays that are uh, covered with milk chocolate or dark chocolate or milk chocolate and um, almond bits. And then this wonderful uh, smart food indulgences, popcorn drizzled with raspberry and um, chocolate. So these are great to put out in bowls. Great to give as a gift, too. They come in beautiful little bags. So if you are going to a party, take one for your hostess. That is, you can bring a great hostess gift. Yeah. I love, I'm glad you included dessert. Yeah. And do you have a place online my audience can go? Yeah, it's videopump.tv. And you can get uh, uh, go on that and you can find out about everything I talked about today. And more than anything else, have a great relaxing holiday and enjoy your own party. C.C. Carmichael, we know you're a trained chef, but we feel like you're one of us. Thank you so very much. <laughs> Thank you much. so much. Great talking to you. Happy holiday. You as well.